Hey, real quickly, um, this is for anyone, so anyone that might see this. Um, I've said quite a bit about this COVID and this whole beast system and everything that's going on. So brethren that visit this channel, welcome, um, that know my stance on it. The Heavenly Father... It's hard to say this. It's very, very hard for me to say this. We better choose. All those that know who Yahushua is, all those that say they're of the light, that say they worship the Most High in spirit and truth, you all better make a decision about society. It's time to make a decision as to the society in which you participate in. What part of the society do you participate in? Whether you're liked or whether you're not doesn't matter. It no longer matters. It, it no, none of it matters. Survival matters as a child of the Most High. Survival. Survival. Survival in the kingdom way. If we know how to give good gifts, if we know how to please our Father, if we know how to be obedient, you know, there are times we're going to be pushed. For instance, I have a training course coming up that they just, they're like, okay, two weeks, you need to be here Saturday. Is that a problem? And then we'll move it around. I said, no, it's not a problem because of the fact that the Saturday, what it is that I'm doing is actually ministry. They don't know that, but I'm, get, I'm getting paid for it. But it's a training area. I don't, I said Saturday is my Sabbath. So it's supposed to be for two Saturdays. I might not even make it through that. I may be switching and doing something else. But my point to you right now is that our decisions, our understanding is based on discernment and wisdom. The Holy Spirit of Wisdom. There are many parents out here. Ooh, pains me to say you parents are going to pay for making your children have to go through the things they have to go through at school. The gender agenda is getting out of control. People thinking that they were vaccinated and then they just got COVID. You know what? If you have a runny nose, you could have allergies. If you feel hot and then cold, you could be postmenopausal. If your feet feel numb, you could be diabetic. All these labels they've put on us in the medical field for so long. And I have been to medical school. Now, I didn't, I didn't get to actually operate on, on human beings, right? But that was something I was interested in at that time. Holistically, and, and what I mean by that is spiritually, I've studied medicine um, to naturally help in all different levels of that. Pain is an interesting feeling. That feeling will cause a person to give up their entire inheritance of the kingdom to sell out their family to be put someone's head on the chopping block basically deliver them up to a cutting board of the devil all of this is meant to break you down
We have choices, brethren, and the choices are not easy. The choices are tough. For example, went up to a country road yesterday, so it was Sunday. I'm extremely tired, so just understand I, I need to catch up on some sleep. I had to sit in front of some trees. I knew I needed to be there. Talk to the Most High, and I knew I needed to be there. Just sitting there. Without phones, without friends, without music and the radio, without the TV, without all these things going on, if a person sits still like this, just sits still in complete silence, they're going to notice everything around themselves. These vices that the enemy puts in front of us, these checker pieces, these pawn schemes, I'm letting you know the dividing in the sand is it's 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 direct. It's very direct. Choose this day who you will serve, Yahusha said. Choose this day. We're going to really need scripturally to be able to quote scriptures of Yahusha when he spoke and then also warnings just when we go in somewhere. I went into a store out in the country and I was told when I got up to the cashier's um, area i was told oh we're what did, how did she say it we're a mask we're a mask wearing how she said it was just interesting i caught on to it she was emphasizing like join us that kind of join us we're mask wearing people here join us Real subtle. And I said, oh, no, no, no. I'm getting ready to leave. You see, it doesn't just say mask required. It says up and over the nose. I wasn't going to put one on. I had some in the car, some masks in the car. I told you all I've spent all of $3 for my own mask. $4 total. Mm-mm. I still have those two. I'm not going to wear them like that. We have to fight. We have to fight for children. We have to fight for survival. Of being able to get in the position of restoration and get out of debt um, live healthy with eating, get through these food shortages, all the kind of things that have, are happening. See, we get very prepared for what's about to come. We don't see the entering into it. We don't see the entering into the, the turmoil. We don't see the entering into the tribulation. We don't see the entering into the next phase, the next season. We have to see us walking into it. We have to see us walking into it. We have to be aware. Our minds have to be open to being aware of entering that that new that newness of what's going to take place. It's not just the preparation. Once you prepare, it's the walking into it. See, I'm in a transition of walking into it. I will not allow. I mean, I appreciate being helped in any way. I appreciate love, and I appreciate um. All of that and honesty, what I don't appreciate and what I will not stand for in my life at this point is just anyone keeping me from serving the most high the way I'm supposed to serve him. That's just something I'm not going to stand for. And I'm going to fight it the whole way. Take a phone away from 
your your you know just just person of this world right just take their phone away <sighs> have them sit in the country in a chair or on the on, on the ground on a blanket just have them lay there for hours and hours and look at the nature there is so much witchcraft going on you guys right now the spiritual warfare is so strong there is so much going on with their guidelines people feel scared and forced let me tell you when i have to use the restroom yeah it's not an easy situation Most High is showing me in my life, like places I have to escape to where I can go, areas I can use as a camp out in the middle of nowhere. Um, there's just so much to this. And I've been preparing for these days for a long, long time in my life, for years. But you never quite know how it's going to look, how it's really going to happen, you know? So my most encouraging word for you today about this subject, please don't give up what is fine. Allow your, your branch to blossom and to be seen by Yahusha. That we may be acceptable in Yahuwah's sight. That we're seeking first the kingdom. We know what our inheritance is. That we're not giving up what is fine. So, a tree is known by its fruits. How it develops, how... Excuse me. <sighs> Excuse me. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, if you are, if you are working, if you are working on being in the, in the light and, and allowing the light to shine and not want any darkness, it will exhaust you right now in this season. It's been, it's been very exhausting for a lot of us. Um, and I'll tell you what that means as well. That means our lamp, our oil is thin. We've had all this oil and we've given it away. We've shared it. I don't have much more oil to share. Excuse me. I need my oil. I need my oil to get through this dry, rough path into the narrow path of righteousness very lonely walk and it's taking a toll <laughs> like I was I was really awake yesterday but it's been so long from yesterday to today with everything and then when we try to accomplish what we try to accomplish like I understand September for me end of this month in September is just going to be like so goal oriented so yes I get persecuted you know it's more just oppressed Going into a cafe or something and needing to use the restroom. And I mean, I just. I don't like the confrontation, but I, I deal with it. I speak my mind. People look at me strange. But look, consider yourself. Just don't consider it strange. Just consider the source of this is the matrix. This is the world that we're in and we're not, or of it, we're not in it, in it. And so now not having a mask, basically you're just, um, it's, it's strange how they did that. People that were vaccine, not wearing a mask anymore. They want to see everybody in a mask. The ones that are not vaccinated are the ones that don't want to wear a mask. Now they're, they're being judged interesting concept so excuse my excuse me with my eyes i am just about to pass out i need some rest some serious rest um i just need a little bit <laughs> a very raw and uncut video 
I need to get on here real quick and speak this. So other videos will be coming out by this evening. I do have a lot more to say. I have a short time to say it in. With that being said, thank you for being here. I hope this uh, somehow hits your heart in another way. All right? Shut up.